how to get all these beautiful new custom maps. Hello and welcome, my name is Ivan Place. After making one guide and then another guide, I am now making the final third guide on how to get new maps into Ravenfield. All you gotta do is go to Steam, press on Library, press on Ravenfield, click on Community Hub and then click the Workshop. In here, you have the Browse button, check the maps. And now you can sort the maps by popularity based on different time limits. On Steam, downloading Workshop content means subscribing to Workshop content. Once you picked the map you want, click on it, check out the screenshots and hit the Subscribe button. Just like you should totally do on my channel only you should also press the enable alerts one. Nearly immediately, I hope, at the bottom you will see that the items have completed. If you want to download multiple things, you can just hover the icons and press the plus icon. Subscribed, subscribed, and if you misclicked or changed your mind, just press this again and it will be deleted. You can download it later again. So you downloaded the maps, but how do you play them? Well, just start Ravenfield normally, go to play, instant action and here is a button custom maps at the top. You can scroll through the maps you downloaded, very nice new menu. Let's try that one. Just hit play and depending on how the map was made it can take a few seconds to sometimes a few minutes. Some maps have issues of being way too huge but hopefully we'll have no troubles. So here we are driving over our teammates in this brand new map. If for some reason you want to keep the map but not have it in the, in the custom map selection menu, you can go to mods and disable the map there. Actually, let's just disable very many, very many maps. And if we go back to custom maps, suddenly a lot of maps are missing. That's just a little management tool for this whole thing. And that's all there is to it. Alright, I hope this helps and I hope to see you in the next video. Until then, ciao!